Driving through the hood, I've gone past this place thousands of times before, but you wouldn't expect much. Nestled in the corner, just getting off the motorway. But we've heard some pretty good things about the yummalicious lunch bar here in Papatoi. More specifically, the bacon and egg pie that we've heard that is a little bit basic, but packed full of flavor. Kind of like this clown. Just the Norms, aka Regan Royale, aka my tag team partner on New FM, aka the guy that does the song parodies and you show it to the mate that kind of out the gate and into that kind of stuff. That's him. We're checking out the finest spots in South Okalani so you don't have to cue that beat. This place, I remember coming to this place at like two in the morning one time. Yeah. And it was open. Yeah. Well, what, what do you know about this? Uh, I stopped in there once or twice. I've seen pies, pies are the, much, the only reason why we're coming here, not in Mangere, is uh, we've done We his... all know what's happened here in the uh, streets of uh, Bakery Run. So, uh, yeah, we're about to do some justice in Papatoi. Yeah, well, let's go, right? Alright, so what's the go-to, my bro? So, we've got, uh... Oh, man. Hey, uh, can I get two steak and cheese? There's not many of that. That's a good thing sometimes, when there's not many pies in there. You know? Yo, yeah, definitely. There's not too many pies as many days. Busy. Breaks Busy. it down, yeah. Bro, I'm keen on a hot dog, bro. Are you keen on a hot dog? Not really. <laughs> Anything? Hey, can I get two, um, banana cakes? Oh, and um, do you have any other two pies that are the same? Uh, bacon and egg. Bacon and egg. Can I have two bacon and eggs, please? What's the go-to? What's the what's the combo? Oh, bro, there's no golden pash, G. So, oh, bro, this bro, this goes hard too, mate. Right? Yeah, yeah. Just, uh, Great combo right there. What you want? Orange. Oh, uh, lemon. Of course, you want the lemon. You know what? I got you, brother. I got you, bro. Don't worry. Sure. Just for this once. Just this once, though. Okay. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I'll get it. <laughs> that was the fat, that was that was the fattest decline I've ever seen in my life. Holy <laughs> Are you everything going to right, bro? Jeez, thank you very much. <laughs> Stay away from the TAP, <laughs> Enough of the TAP, eh? Shake So today we have our second cheese as normal. We've got our bacon and egg. And we've got, like, I went in earlier and I said, what's, what's your best? What's the best thing you got? They mm. said that their, their, uh, their banana cake is... You know the... how much I love bananas. Oh. <laughs> oh, especially when you peel it back. When you peel the banana back. Hey, green bananas, green the nice banana. solid ones. <laughs> the nice ripe hard ones. Oh man. Nice hey, um, solid bananas. Bro, like you moved up here, eh? You moved back yeah, up Yeah, I moved often? back home now. Sharks. Bro, are you a bit worried, bro, that like, you know, a lot of the stalkers will come out, bro? Uh no, nah, no, nah, I'm, I'm I'm pretty much. Kind ready. of banking on it. <laughs> <laughs> kind of hoping on it because <laughs> nobody nobody knows me in Palmy. Nobody knew me in Palmy. Nobody knows me in my own house. I'll be like, hey kids, who the who, who, who's, who's that man? Who's that man? Where's that my real dad? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Kids, they don't watch this. Oh, right. man. Um, uh, bro, no golden pash. That's fine. That's fine. We'll save the pash, believe yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, what, I'd rather have a, a, a lemon and lime pash. Oh, there we go. Um, Deep spring going what's your, How does your love of lemon and lime come into this, bro? Because you're a big fan of the green uh, fruit burst. Yes. It's funny how, like... It, it just it revolves uh, around me. <laughs> and, uh, it's the funniest thing is because I know this guy... Uh, Probably more than anyone else I've had on the show. And I hate this guy more than anyone <laughs> we've ever had as well. I hate your guts. <laughs> and that's why I'm a very big fan of the lime, is because I'm quite sour. Quite <laughs> sour in here, inside. Oh, uh, sour inside. <laughs> I've got the uh, deep spring orange and mango, because uh, that mango heart, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> hey! All right, let's get All into the right. steak and cheese, bro. Now, you're a fan of the um, of the Hong Kong bakery, huh? Is it a... Massive fan. Yeah? Yeah. Sorry we couldn't go there, we've been trespassed. <laughs> we've been trespassed uh, oh, for the next man. five years. Uh, <laughs> thanks to one um, boomer. Ooh, that's interesting, bro. Have a look. It's kind of like... Bro. I'll be honest, 
I'm hungry. <laughs> no, no. But yeah, texture looks pretty good. Nice and puffy. I like yeah. that. I like that. All right, bro. Two bites. Two Let's bites. Man, bro, tell me what you're thinking. What's the what's the thought process going on right now? Bro, it's not that. It's oh, it's better than Hong Kong, man. Yeah. Yeah. It's not a lot of. It's not a lot of content in that. Yeah. It's very. It's pastry driven, if you know what I mean. Yeah, it, it tastes like a, a cheap pie, to be honest. Yeah, it kind of tastes like a. Why are we so quiet? Because you know the owners. <laughs> <really good>. Thanks. <laughs> but, um, it's not a lot in it, and it's really flimsy. Like, the, yo, if you were eating this in a car, it would fall. It would flop apart. Bro. It would flop, flop, flop. Look at that. Flop, 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 flop. Not like a banana though. Flop. Less rocks. No, no, no. banana. I'm gonna give that one a five. Actually, I'm gonna go five point five because I did like the cheese content and I did like the pastry it was really nice. And I'm, I'm gonna go with your girl for five as well. Uh, but if I, only because I'm hungry, but if I wasn't hungry, I'd probably give it a four, to be honest, to be honest. Yeah. Uh, pie tasted a bit cheap. Um, steak was a bit stale there and- um, The floppiness. Was, yeah, yeah. The floppiness, yeah. Because if you are eating it on the road, that would be a messy pie. Yeah, definitely. We've got to take that into account. Bacon and egg, a little bit more, you know, like it's not so, you can eat these on just Yeah, you can stuff these up kind of thing. Yeah. Well, you Overcook can. an egg maybe. Yeah, yeah, put some stuff in it, it shouldn't be. Yeah, uh, ratio of bacon to egg. Ooh, bro. Come on, bro. What shouldn't be in this? If I see vegetables in this, fuck. This thing is going straight into this window. To say two bro. bites, bro. Oh, we don't have to do you can have more than one if you want. Yeah, it's up to you, bro. I know you're a hungry man right now. All right. <laughs> All right. Just so I can get down with. Bro, I like that it's like a full egg. It's not like mixed. Mm. Like I got like some yolk and some white. It's moist. Yep. And it's light. Make sure it's hard. And then just when you bite into it, you think, you know, you think it's going to be dry. You yeah. bite into it. It's not, not dry at all. What's your ratings? Um, bro, you're the guest, you go first, yeah. I'd give it a 8.5. Hmm. That's pretty generous. Yeah, I, 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 it's either I'm hungry or the pie was actually really good. Nah, yeah, it ticked all the boxes for me. Yeah. What yeah. other boxes? Tell me. Uh, it's got to be moist inside, good ratio between bacon and egg. Um, eggs not too overcooked in yep. there. No vegetables. No vegetables. And pastry was nice, nice flaky. That was a buttery, flaky, crispy crust. So what I was saying is, <laughs> so uh, my rating, it will be a solid six and a half out of, wow. uh, yeah, I'm going to go six and a half. Yeah, what's the reasoning behind that? Um, I think I just wanted it more and it was really, um, it, it did tick the boxes, mm. it's very basic. Um, I would have liked just a little bit more, a little bit more content in there, but um, it was good, it's a, good, it's a nice, nice bacon and egg pie. It did remind me of the um, Irvine's. Um, the ham from it is really, ah, and the uh, pastry, how it was like, you can soften it down. Yeah. Like that. All right, yeah. all right, okay. Six and a half. Let's, let's seven. rate the, um, the raffer. <laughs> okay, highly recommended banana cake. Um, we've unwrapped it, it is ready to roll. Um, I'm the banana. I see little pieces of banana in there. Yep. You know how fruit. I feel about bananas already. I, I already know, bro. That's why I chose this. We need to bring you over to the dark side, bro. You know, a, a good, a, oh, a good banana cake. Banana you do? Cake, what's yeah. your um? Man, flies around. What's your What's your hot drink that goes with banana cake? It has to be a uh, Milo, G. Yeah, I'm a Milo kind of guy as well. All right, man. I do. What are you looking for when, you, when, when you're looking for a banana? Yeah. What are you looking for? It's a good level of, um, it's not too sweet. It's moist as hell. Some, yeah, it is. Bro, actually, yes. That's a winner, bro. Any cake that's moist, there's just the right amount of frosting on the top, too. Mm. You've swung me, bro. You've swung me around. 
Hey, you've I'm won me to, over. You're supposed to be the banana guy. You, you've won me over here, mate. Okay. <laughs> you've won. You've won your boy over. Oh, all right. I'm gonna give this a good eight, bro. Yeah. This is a solid. This is solid. Um, cheap too. Like, like this place isn't like gourmet. Yeah. But, and it's good. It's nice. Yeah, I'd so, give man. this a uh, a nine. Ooh. Yeah. Not, not, yeah, man. I'm not too often I get, you know eat banana cakes, but um, this is really nice. I know it's banana, but in terms of moisture. How would you compare this to the uh, Windmill Bakery, bro? Oh, damn, you can't cut the yeah, Bro, that thing, thing is. Yeah. I think of beauty. Yeah, that's I'll a, tell you a few things it's moist. Yeah, I've seen it. It tasted a few things. Elaborate. Like tell us. Um, what was that? Oh. Some lamb flaps. Uh oh. Sorry, I can't see you. Oh shucks. So <laughs> hey. Year two thousand, bro. It's been a it's been a long time getting you on, bro. And there was this ongoing joke that we're never ever gonna put you on. But thank you for scraping to the bottom of the barrel and checking your boy a little episode here. Yeah, thanks for just on a random ass bakery that's got nothing to do with me or my <laughs> upcoming. Come on, bro. You're not Joseph Parker. We should, mate. we need to do Hong Kong Bakery Part Two, I think. I think me, you, and Boomer need to. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm bringing. I have to bring somebody to. To kind of have my back at all times because I know you'll just throw me Holy under the bus. Yeah, God. I know the whole thing will be like, oh, it's a 10. Oh, I'm going to bring the whole army. This is amazing. Come on, Cheryl. <laughs> Cheryl and Rudy, Ruby and, 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 and Rudolph, come over here. Let's let's talk. <laughs> Holy yeah, God. Oh, okay. Hey, thanks, my brother. Always appreciate you. Right. Thanks for having me, man. And we'll see you guys on the next episode. <laughs>